the royal wedding behold he cometh with clouds and every eye shall see him and they also which pierced him and all kindred of the earth shall wail because of him even so amen revelation chapter 1 verse 7 On May 19, 2018, all eyes were focused on England for the wedding of Prince Harry and his American bride Meghan Markle. In the weeks leading up to the royal wedding, all you heard was people discussing the upcoming wedding and wondering in anticipation about the details. The outfit, reception venue, guest list, and participants. History was made and England was reminded about Christianity because of the way the services and festivities were conducted. We have another royal wedding that is soon to take place. The groom is coming for his jewels that comprise his bride, the church. Too often, however, we seem to forget that we should be focused on this wedding, the second coming of Christ. For this wedding, however, we won't be glued to our computers or television because Jesus will descend through the clouds with his angels and every eye will see him. We do not know when the second coming will take place, but we do know Jesus is coming and we need to be ready. So then, just as you receive Christ Jesus as Lord, continue to live your lives in him. Colossians chapter 2 verse 6 We should not be too focused and troubled about worldwide troubles, news headlines, and all the different ideas about how the last events will take place. We need to be thinking about Jesus. Are we allowing Him to prepare us, His jewels, so that we will be ready when He returns? Let us not focus on the trivial things on this world, but rather on Jesus and His plans for us regarding His soon-coming royal wedding. May we be ready as were the five wise virgins in the story of Christ. Let's not waste our energy on that which does not have eternal value, but rather on helping others be prepared to be jewels in His crown as well. When he cometh to make up his jewels, all jewels, precious jewels, his love and his own. Like the stars in the morning, his bright crown according, they shall shine in their beauty, bright gems for his crown. Camellia e Castle. So, what do you think about this story? Comment down below and share your thoughts.